Misalignment between machines can cause unscheduled downtime, increased power consumption, and increased vibration. Machines are aligned at the coupling point because this is the point of rotational energy transmission. Most machines are coupled by a short flex coupling. A short flex coupling has two flex planes where misalignment occurs. That misalignment is defined as an angle at each of these planes. A coupling is categorized as a short flex when those points are less than four inches apart. Because the misalignment points are so close together, the misalignment is standardized as offset in mils and angularity in mils per inch for a 10 inch coupling. A spacer shaft is just like a short flex coupling. It also has two flex planes of misalignment where angles occur. As the flex planes of misalignment become farther apart, the short flex standard of offset and angularity should no longer be applied. Due to the geometry of the layout, the machines are aligned so that the spacer shaft is aligned within the allowable projected offset at each flex plane. The amount of allowable projected offset increases with each inch of spacer shaft length. In the Ludeca tolerance table for spacer shafts, you have two columns, excellent and fair. Take the length of the spacer shaft and multiply it by this number. That gives you the allowable offset. Remember that a longer spacer shaft gives you more allowable offset. This is geometry working in your favor because the longer spacer shaft allows for more movement of your machinery while still maintaining the allowable angle for each point. The greatest difficulty that is encountered with spacer shaft alignment is that it takes too long to complete, especially when the spacer shaft tolerances are not used. Because a large foot correction may be necessary to bring the machines into alignment, a common problem encountered on spacer shaft alignments is becoming bolt bound. Longer spacer shafts could cause the laser to move across the detector as you rotate the shafts and even move out of range altogether. All Ludeca laser systems include the InfiniRange feature that lets you move the laser back into the detector regardless of how badly the machine was initially aligned. If you have an obstruction to line of sight along the spacer shaft, like a fan shroud, the machine train mode allows you to perform the spacer shaft alignment by measuring both couplings. The move simulator feature in spacer shaft mode allows you to predict the outcome of an alignment based on the moves you plan to make. Live move allows you to monitor the alignment as you make positional adjustments to the machines. This is the only system that monitors moves in the vertical and horizontal direction at the same time. Once your spacer shaft alignment is completed, simply print your detailed full color alignment report to your flash drive to document the successful completion of your alignment.